Yo, what's up guys? Uh, day eight, I'm gonna go study some more, do another hour of study session. Hopefully I learn some more. I did like an after action report where I'm like figuring out what I gotta learn. I got a notebook so I can like write stuff down and stuff. And I'm gonna go head to the gym in about an hour. Uh, gonna do push day and then gonna do some runs. Might do some more like exercises like forearms or looking into other stuff, but I don't feel that well today, so it might be a little bit slower. I think I ate too much last night, and then I ate a bunch this morning because I'm I'm on a, I'm on a bulk, so I eat like a shit ton of chicken, and I don't feel that well. So I'm gonna I'm gonna wait for my food to digest, then I'll head to the gym. So it might be an hour, it might be two hours, but you know who knows. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get to studying. So I'll see y'all when I head at the gym. Yo, what's up, guys? Uh, I'm at gym now. So I finished most of my workout already. I'm gonna do lateral raises, and then I will do skull crushers, and then push downs, and then I'm gonna do my push ups, and then I'm gonna go run. So, uh, everyone left. I'm in the gym now. It's uh, pretty late. But, uh, it's one of the good things about having a pretty small gym is there's not that many people. So, I can kind of do this. But, I didn't wanna like annoy people by talking. Like, most people there will bully me if I. I was talking like that, or just vlogging, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna go through my lat races, and then I'll do the skull crushers, and then lat pull downs, you know, uh, tricep push downs, or pull downs, whatever, and then I will do push ups, and then go run for half an hour, get home, study, and uh, yeah, I'll do that. Okay, I got done with my uh, like basically all my exercises except for push-ups so I gotta do 200 I'm gonna try a new method to do more which is like I do my max like the most I can do then I set a timer for two or three minutes I do my max again because I used to do uh, 20 reps just doing uh, like 20 reps wait a minute 20 reps 20 reps wait a minute a little bit of a tongue twister but uh I realized when I did a, a push-up competition with uh, one of the gym owners. He fucking beat me and I did push-ups a lot. I mean, it might be because he's been working out longer, but like my whole thing I used to do before I, I actually started going to the gym was push-ups. Like I only did push-ups basically. And then some like workout videos. But uh, damn. I thought I could beat him and I didn't. So I gotta train more on that. Cause I can only do 30. Uh, I only did 30. But uh, my max like, all time max like PR for push ups is 55, and I won't be able to do that like normally, like any any situation. I want to try, I don't know if I can, maybe I'm gonna attempt it uh, doing a hundred push ups in a row by the end of this year. I've done a thousand in a day, but I was doing uh, 10 reps, then wait a minute, 10 reps for like four hours. I was watching uh, Netflix while I was doing it. I wrote it all down. I was supposed to get it done in like an hour or two, but I, I lost track of time. And then I did it uh, within like four hours. So, yeah. But uh, I'm waiting a few minutes because I want like my, my body to like my arms to rest before I did push ups. So, I'll record me doing some push ups after this three minutes or so is up. So, yeah. Okay, so I finished my push-ups. I'm gonna go head back and then go run in my neighborhood for however long. Hopefully I just get a mile and I'm gonna head back because it's really dark. So I'm gonna do that and then once I get back, I'm gonna study, maybe read a little bit and then probably head to bed. So yeah, I will see y'all after that run or when I start it. So see ya. Yeah, what's up guys? I just got finished running a mile. Uh, I'm pretty exhausted. Gonna take a, a shower again. My shins are like fucking inflated. They hurt pretty bad. I, I ran with my whole bag as well, so it has like my huge gallon water bottle and everything else. But this was a crazy improvement. I ran basically like the whole time. I mean, I used to not be able to run like a quarter of my street, but I basically just ran like the whole thing, except for like maybe a minute or two walking like on the way back and that was only because of my 
my shins. Like, honestly, I could have ran the whole time. I mean, I, I think so. Probably. I mean, I took, like, a small break, like, walking for, like, 10 steps, and then I got catch my breath. And But I was basically running the whole time. I'm, I wasn't sprinting, obviously, but I was, like, jogging at a pretty fast pace. And it was a crazy improvement. I think it's the air or something, because I just, like, felt like my lungs weren't as working, working as hard. But, like, I ran a mile, and I remember, like, a few months ago, literally... I couldn't jog down my street without getting tired, but now I basically just ran the whole street, the whole area. It was like a mile. So, crazy big improvement in my cardio. Um, Yeah, I think I might need to train calves, honestly, because I think that's the big thing is, like, if you train your calves, you know, you're training it to, you know, sustain more weight. So, like, when you, like, do, like, uh, like this, or, like, if you, like, you know, when you run, like, your foot kind of just, like, does that, like, when you push off. If you train it with a lot of weight, then that regular push off of running feels a lot easier. I don't know. I think that's my little hypothesis, but I didn't do any kind of like post uh, workout or pre workout like breathing technique or anything. I didn't do any of that. I literally just, I got home and I ran basically. I didn't take like a 20 minute break. I didn't do all my push ups. I did 100, not 200. I'm probably going to do them in a minute or once I get out of the shower. I know I said I did them, but I'm like, it was dark and I didn't want to waste another, you know, 20 minutes or not waste it, but be there for another 20 minutes. But I could have ran them on my gym complex, but I kind of just wanted to see what it was like. But uh, I was kind of surprised though, because like, I didn't know I could run that long, but uh, crazy big improvements cardio wise. So now the main thing that I need to work on is uh, studying for the ASVAB, because a lot of the math stuff I don't really understand. I used to think like, oh, I, I wouldn't get in. Uh, to, to the Space Force or to any part of the military because of my fucking cardio because my lungs are so shit from playing games forever. But, uh... My dog's right here. But, uh, yeah. I mean, now I'm training it and I'm like... Uh... Damn, I'm sweaty. Yeah, it's, it's major improvements. Um... I got an interview tomorrow. Gonna apply for some... Play or gonna interview... Uh, and then tomorrow I got an interview and then I'm going to hopefully make some money and then go back to my own. And I've told you all this before, but I'm pretty excited. My dog's being weird. But uh, yeah, I'm going to do that. I might study tonight. I'm cracking my back right now. That bag is... That bag does not do anything good for your back. Definitely not. But uh, yeah, I'm going to uh, go take a shower. I think I'm going to wrap it up for today. Um, today was all right. I mean, I woke up super late. I slept in. I, I sleep in. I sleep for like 12 hours normally. Maybe, maybe just, I'm just, I don't know. But uh, I stayed up all night playing games. I don't know. I think I'm slipping on that aspect with self-improvement. But I've been my physical fitness has gone up crazy. I've been taking creatine. I dry scoop creatine. I thought it was gonna taste awful. It did. It didn't taste the greatest, but I, it was like super easy. But uh, I also had Propel, which was like a flavored water. But uh, I did that. I studied for an hour. Uh, I just took notes. It wasn't that. I didn't do that much. I think I might do two hours. What I might do is just like. Put on some music or some like binaural beats or some kind of like lo-fi audio or something and then just do like a four hour session every weekend like every day on the weekend and then on the weekdays i'll do two hours or i, I probably should just do four in general because i i, I want to know like everything so i because it's like i have like four months to get a good score i can take a, a test and then retake it i think uh in like a month or two but uh i'm gonna grind studying i might just do that tonight i might just honestly just uh study all night but uh yeah i kind of go to bit, go to bed early because i got an interview but uh yeah it's gonna be a pretty eventful week hopefully if i i well, not eventful but productive at least yeah i'm not gonna do my my uh my smma anymore i don't know i don't know if i talked about that in this channel i might have my uh thing i was trying to do with the course but um is that it? Yeah, I'm just gonna think I'm just gonna go all in with uh with physical fitness and just studying the ASVAB and just outside it for four months and do some kind of like 
uh, David Goggins, you know, when he lost 100 pounds in three months. I'm going to do something a lot lighter than that, obviously. But uh, I still got to train my cardio and stuff. I'm going to try to run every day. I'm probably not going to be able to run tomorrow because, I mean, let's, let's see how my shins are because my shins are fucking hurting. And I haven't, I haven't like, destroyed my shins and my calves this much in a while. Like, when I usually go on runs, they don't hurt this bad after. And especially my back. I might just do some yoga or something. But, uh... Uh, I'll do yoga, I'll do some stretching, I'll ice, do the, the whole rice thing. But uh, my back is fucked. Because I think it kept, like, the, the big water bottle kept hitting my back and just messed it up. But uh, I think I'll try to run tomorrow. I don't, I don't like running on treadmills because it just feels so limiting. It just doesn't feel like I'm going fast, you know. But, like, I can sense the distance when I run. Like, I know, like, I know what an improvement is, you know. And I'm pretty sure within a month, I'll be able to easily run a mile, you know? Because, I mean, this creatine has definitely helped, but I'm not at 30 days. I'm at, like, day 10 or day 9, so I don't know. But at, after day 30, it's going to definitely help a lot, plus just constant training. I know when I get into the air, the, the Space Force, almost at the Air Force. Echo, could you fucking move? My dog's a weirdo. Yeah, but, uh... I'm not gonna have access to creatine, probably not, unless I like get my own like housing. But without, with like boot camp and stuff, I'm definitely not. But uh, I'm just gonna train hella cardio every single day. I'm gonna try to aim for at least a mile a day, and then I'll up it to three in like a month or two, probably a month. But uh, yeah, I think I'm doing pretty good, honestly. I haven't been meditating. That's probably why I've had a lot of like intrusive thoughts and like uh, just kind of like impulsivity with things, but uh, not a lot of. Yeah, I don't know. But uh, I've definitely seen the benefits, or the I've definitely lost the benefits of meditation, or a lot of them, since I haven't been meditating. It's a, you got to make it a consistent practice, or else you lose a lot of it. But I've just been like so like I wake up super late and I just kind of forget. But. Uh, Shit. Yeah, but uh, I might meditate right now, maybe. I might do that. But uh, yeah. I think I'm going to end this video. Day 8 or 7. I'm going to lose track of these one day. But uh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see y'all tomorrow.